Hi, I'm Scott Flowers with Cloud Ninjas. Today we're going to continue our series on the Dell PowerEdge R720 server. In this video, we're going to show you how to rack your R720. Let's get going. All right, so now we're going to show you actually how to put your server into the rack. So first things first, we're going to grab the left rail. You notice it says left on the rail. Uh, so we want to face it where the left is facing up and on the left side. Um, I like to do this with two people, so Angel's going to help me. He's in the back here. So Angel, let's do 14 and 15. So I'm going to have him line his up and put him in first. You'll hear him click into place. So now I'm going to come over here to 14 and 15 and line mine up properly. And then I'm going to push this in. You're going to hear click in. And now it's officially in. So if I were to try to move it or shake it, it is physically into the rack right now. Now if I want to remove it, this blue clip right here, I would just pull this and I can take it back out. So I'll go ahead and I'll put it back in one more time. You'll hear it click into place. So now we'll go ahead uh, and we'll do the next side and you'll see that these are the inners as, as well. And when we do this side, I'll show you how to do the inners. All right, so this is gonna be the uh, the right rail. And again, it's gonna say right on the rail kit. You wanna line it up so that right is facing up. And again, we'll do the exact same ones, Angel, uh, 14 and 15. So you go ahead and put yours in first. All right, so you heard his click in and then I'm gonna go ahead and line mine up. And you'll hear it click into place. So again, if I were to shake it, it is firmly in there. Um, it is not gonna fall out. So now I'm gonna show you the inners a little bit better. So when you pull the inners out, you'll hear it click into place. And if you wanted to put the inner in, you can't just push it back in, you have to push this down. And when you push this down, you can now slide your inners back on in. All right, so now we're actually gonna put your R720 into the racks. So we're gonna, or into the rails, I should say. So we're gonna slide the inner rails out. And you hear them click into place. Um, and when they do, they lock in. You physically can't put them back in. And you'll notice that there are notches that are carved out on the rails. And as uh, Angel holds this here, you'll see these little rivets that stick up. So essentially what we're gonna do is line those rivets up with these notches and set them down. We always try to put the back one in first and then kind of work our way down. So let's go ahead and do this now. So let's line everything up. Okay, is yours in? Yes. All right, so let's just go ahead and kind of lay it down. All right, perfect. All of mine are in. Yours all in? All right, perfect. So then we're just going to slide it back. But again, in order to slide it back, you do need to push the side buttons. And now we can just slide our R720 right into the rack. So thanks for stopping by today, guys. If you find this video useful, do us a favor, click that like and smash that subscribe. And if you're looking for any custom built Dell servers or HPE, Super Micro, IBM, Cisco, you name it, we'd love the opportunity to win your business. Please email us at sales at cloudninja.com. That's sales at cloudninja.com. Thanks again for stopping by. Take care, guys.